when children are working with ramps, they are truly engineers. They consider pitch, slope, velocity. They may not be able to use those terms, but as teachers and as parents, we know that those are the skills and the concepts that they're working on. We find that when children use discovery ramps, they work together. Maybe you want this. There's more cooperation. There's more negotiation because something may or may not go exactly as they had planned. It doesn't work. What if we make a hill of wood chips? No, like, no, like right here, so it's still going down. Like, I'll show you, like this. These ramps are portable. You can move them about. Things in motion capture our attention. Whoa! And for this reason, discovery ramps work very well in the early childhood classroom. Discovery ramps are well named. They are about discovery. I think we need a stronger rock right here. They're about challenge. They're about questioning, testing, and design. Questions for children. Wait, to do it on this what will fit in the ramp? Will materials roll on top of the ramp? Do we have to adjust it? Okay, I can do this. What will work to make stands for the ramps, to make platforms for them? All of these things will come out in children's natural play. And for you, the teacher or the parent, to see the child thinking in action is priceless.